Today's video is going to be a little different as we take the opportunity to step outside of our comfort zones in partnership with our friends at Cotton. As most of you know, we recently made a major cross-country move which can definitely drum up several emotions. So today we are going to take time throughout this video to reflect back as we get set to renovate my office here in our new home. My office, it's like one of the most important places in the house, right? This is where we come to make money and really just get that work on. But this doesn't look like an office. This looks more like a like a yard sale in here. So we're doing everything to totally um, make this place look better. First thing that's gonna go are these mirrors. All of this stuff needs to be organized. I have a desk, I have all the things, but see these walls? See how they lean like that? None of my stuff fits in here because it just, it doesn't. And the only place I would have that's flat to put my tall desk is against that wall. And you can't cover doors because you can't cover doors. We've got a couch here with a huge fish on it. Mm -hmm. Oh crap. Let's get to it. Oh. So we all, we only have one day to do this because my mom is watching Shell all day today. So we are gonna try and, well, okay, the boxes are already gone, so that's Progress. good. <laughs> but we're gonna paint this whole room and get it all set up in one day. <gasps> Corey, Corey. Corey, <laughs> are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Mr. Safety, ladies and gentlemen, right there. Yep, that's, that's what he's called. Mr. Safety. <laughs> okay, in all seriousness, guys, I'm being really, really silly right now because I am a little bit, like, overwhelmed. And when I'm silly like that, when I'm really crazy, honestly, that's kind of a, what do you call it when you, when defense you, mechanism? it's a defense mechanism. It's to keep myself positive from the stuff that's really bothering me. So I, I laugh at things or I, I make fun of myself because I'm stressed out about something. And this is something that I've been stressed out about. Well, today, all that's going to change. Mm -hmm. As we were out shopping for potential office items, um, I was, I was honestly like stressed. I'm not an interior decorator. I'm not somebody who can just visualize how a room supposed to look I can make videos I can make music I, I can I can do artwork and all that stuff but I can't do this for whatever reason I looked all over Pinterest and all over different websites and, and Google you know to try to find something and how you can turn a room like this into a nice looking office but there's just nothing the reason that I really want this to be in my office is because it's so separated from the house it's like it has its own wing it's above the garage and I can be as loud as I want to be for my music for my videos and for gaming because you know gaming hey. what? okay i'm gonna stop staring at stuff and help you <laughs> i'm just trying to get over this before we can paint we have to get these mirrors off of this wall we are lucky you can kind of stick your fingers like behind the mirror and wobble it so they're not like glued to the wall which will make it a lot easier but getting the molding off that's gonna be the tricky part All right you're experienced in this right yeah totally where this is my hammer and this is my separator. I'm just gonna take this side right here and just rip it off. Because we got a little bit, but... Are you okay? I don't know yet. I don't want to open my hand. I just, I just pulled on it and it all exploded on my hands and I felt glass go across my fingers. I see no blood. Yay! <laughs> All right, that's it. We're getting safe up in here. Got our glasses in there case glass shards come shooting in our face while this <laughs> stuff explodes. Yeah, this is way worse than I thought it was going to be. Me too. After my incident. Yay, and glass. All things, let's, let's like really get safe. So we've been finding more and more things to make this job easier and safer. I found a uh, razor blade, which is going to be really helpful to like go through and cut the caulking. Um, and that way we can just pop these mirrors off without them breaking. There you go. Yeah, it's working really, really well. Just loosen them up. Success! And we managed to actually find a couple extra outlets, which Yay. is super, super cool. Okay, so obviously, you know, I said earlier, today's video is sponsored by Cotton. And the clothes that we're wearing are cotton. It's all cotton, all cotton made. And you guys can actually get these clothes for yourself um, in the link down below in the video description. I love these shirts, by the way. I'm I freaking know. awesome, right? We're talking about getting out of our comfort zone, and it's just like, rah, like a shark. Just yeah, a big, they're so this cool. big, scary looking shark, but it's like <laughs> life is scary sometimes. And, you know, it's, it's a scary shirt that's quite comfortable. 
It's officially dark outside and <laughs> dark in here because yes. we are putting lights up. Let's hope I did this right. <laughs> Otherwise, we're going to have some problems. Look at this, guys. Oh my gosh. Yeah. What a big change. Ah, oh, dude, I feel so much better. Like, I feel like I can actually work in this room. <laughs> So we got it separated into a, a couple of different places. We've actually decided that this is going to be partially Kristen's room. Yeah, if I ever want to edit the vlogs, I can go sit like over there and I have my nice little pink rug and then I can hang out with you while you're working. I'm trying to figure out whether or not I want to mount the TV. Right. Um, we don't have a base yet and there's, you know, we got this thing which I'd like to fix. It's mm -hmm. like an intercom system that goes all the way through the whole house. Yeah, This would be, be so convenient to have. Also, we have this awesome painting, but I don't really know where to put it. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know. My <laughs> office, the office where all the magic will yeah, be made yeah. and all of that is gonna happen. And look so at this. Good. I still got a lot of uh, soundproofing to do because obviously, you know, music, I do music. And we got this spot over here. Now, don't judge me. <laughs> uh, we haven't quite finished this. This was going to be uh, my recording studio, um, but I realized, I was like, you know, after getting these things, yeah. they're fantastic. I'm going to put some um, some soundproof things like this on these all the way down, and it opens up into three different things, and then I can put them around me, so I don't have to worry about any echo in the room or right. anything like that. And I did some audio tests to see if you could hear anything in the other house if I'm blasting these speakers. Nothing. You can't hear Amazing. anything. Amazing. So... I can sit here and just play my didgeridoo and nobody is going to get upset. But anyway, so this, this is it, guys. It's amazing. Dude, yeah. I, I just I want to say a huge thank you to Cotton for, you know, helping us get outside of our comfort zones. Like, yeah, talk about getting outside your comfort zone. I worked at one of the best engineering firms in the country, in the world, if I do say so myself. And then... You quit to be a YouTuber. I quit to be a YouTuber, yeah. Which is awesome and also scary. Super scary, yeah. That was a big, big decision. Mm -hmm. um, best decision I've ever made besides like marrying this guy. A lot of the people I went to school with, a lot of the people I worked with, like they would just say, wait, you're quitting to do what? You gotta think like, if you're making tons and tons of money, but you're working so much that you get home and you're tired and you're just like, oh, you yeah. spend all of your living energy to do one thing that you're not in love with, then like money is pointless because you're you're you're, you're burning all of your good years to yeah. do that. And, uh, and I know there's a lot of people that still go through the grind, but that's why you should get outside of your comfort zone every now and then. Go out, try something new and, and live that life outside of the box. Yeah. Get, get comfy and uh and don't get comfy you know? yeah. <laughs> like, no, like, like have your core and then go out just do stuff yeah through all through all of it no matter how crazy it is we have each other yeah mm -hmm. yeah that's our comfort yep it's our main comfort yeah you get other comforts sure. but it's our main comfort yep that's why we sit so far apart on the couch we look pretty close on camera <laughs> i could just do ah. this though <laughs> all right so Corey is getting back to work uh, yeah. or, or playing his didgeridoo <laughs> it, it's work <laughs> if you guys want to see any of the like cool stuff we have for the room or any of the stuff we're wearing be sure and check out our live each day collection on the cotton website it is fabric of our lives.com slash live each day there'll be a link in the description below you can click on to and again a super special thank you to cotton for pushing us to get outside of our comfort zone and redo the office and reflect on the past couple years. It's good to do that every once in a while. So thank you again, and we will see you guys next time. Bye.